See Sigebert II of Essex for the Saxon ruler by that name. Siegbert II, 601 to 613, or Sigisbert II, was the illegitimate son of Theuderic II, from whom he inherited the kingdoms of Burgundy and Austrasia in 613. However, he fell under the influence of his great grandmother, Brunhilda. Warnachar, mayor of the Palace of Austrasia, had Siegbert brought before a national assembly, where he was proclaimed king by the nobles over both his father's kingdoms. However, when the kingdom was invaded by Clotaire II of Neustria, Warnachar and Rado, mayor of the Palace of Burgundy, betrayed Siegbert and Brunhilde and joined with Clotaire, recognizing Clotaire as rightful regent and guardian of Siegbert and ordering the army not to oppose the Neustrians. Brunhilde and Siegbert met Clotaire's army on the Aisne, but the patrician Alethius, Duke Rocco, and Duke Sigved deserted her host and Brunhilde and Siegbert were forced to flee, before being taken by Clotaire's men at Lake Nucatel. Brunhilde, little Siegbert and Siegbert's younger brother Corbo were executed by Clotaire's orders, and Austrasia and Neustria were reunited under Clotaire's rule, who now ruled the entire kingdom of the Franks. <laughs> 